Accordions are a family of box-shaped musical instruments of the bellows-driven free reed aerophone type, colloquially referred to as a squeeze box. A person who plays the accordion is called an accordionist. The concertina and bandoneon are related, the harmonium and American reed organ are in the same family. The instrument is played by compressing or expanding the bellows while pressing buttons or keys, causing valves, called pallets, to open, which allow air to flow across strips of brass or steel, called reeds, that vibrate to produce sound inside the body. The performer normally plays the melody on buttons or keys on the right-hand manual, and the accompaniment, consisting of bass and preset chord buttons, on the left-hand manual. The accordion is widely spread across the world. In some countries it is used in popular music, whereas in other regions it tends to be more used for dance pop and folk music and as well as in regional and is often used in folk music in Europe. North America and South America. Nevertheless, in Europe and North America, some popular music acts also make use of the instrument. Additionally, the accordion is also used in Cajun, Zydeco, jazz music and in both solo and orchestra performances of classical music. The piano accordion is the official city instrument of San Francisco, California. The oldest name for this group of instruments is harmonica, from the Greek harmonikos, meaning harmonic, musical. Today, native versions of the name accordion are more common. These names refer to the type of accordion patented by Cyril Damien, which concerned automatically coupled chords on the bass side. Construction. Accordions have many configurations and types. What may be technically possible to do with one accordion could be impossible with another. Some accordions are bisonoric, producing different pitches depending on the direction of bellows movement. Others are unisonoric and produce the same pitch in both directions. Some use a chromatic button board for the right-hand manual. Others use a diatonic button board for the right-hand manual. Yet others use a piano-style musical keyboard for the right-hand manual. Some can play in different registers. Craftsmen and technicians may tune the same registers differently, personalizing the end result. Such as an organ technician might voice a particular instrument. Universal Components Bellows The bellows is the most recognizable part of the instrument, and the primary means of articulation. Similar to a violin's bow, the production of sound in an accordion is in direct proportion to the motion of the player. The bellows is located between the right and left hand manuals, and is made from pleated layers of cloth and cardboard, with added leather and metal. It is used to create pressure and vacuum, driving air across the internal reeds and producing sound by their vibration, applied pressure increasing the volume. The keyboard touch is not expressive and does not affect dynamics. All expression is affected through the bellows. Some bellows effects as illustrated below. Bellows used for volume control, fade, repeated change of direction, which has been popularized by Louis Gonzaga and is extensively used in Foro and called Reis Folengo in Brazil. Constant bellows motion while applying pressure at intervals. Constant bellows motion to produce clear tones with no resonance. Using the bellows with the silent air button gives the sound of air moving, which is sometimes used in contemporary compositions particularly for this instrument. Body The accordion's body consists of two wood boxes joined together by the bellows. These boxes house reed chambers for the right and left hand manuals, respectively. Each side has grills in order to facilitate the transmission of air in and out of the instrument, and to allow the sound to better project. The grill for the right hand manual is usually larger and is often shaped for decorative purposes. The right hand manual is normally used for playing the melody and the left hand manual for playing the accompaniment. However, skilled players can reverse these roles. The size and weight of an accordion varies depending on its type, layout and playing range, which can be as small as to have only one or two rows of basses and a single octave on the right-hand manual, to the standard 120 bass accordion and through to large and heavy 160 bass free bass converter models. 
pallet mechanism the accordion is an aerophone. The manual mechanism of the instrument either enables the airflow or disables it. Variable components There is a wide range of instruments that are called accordion. The different types have varying components. All instruments have red ranks of some format. Not all have switches. The most typical accordion is the piano accordion, which is used for many musical genres. Another type of accordion is the button accordion, which is used in several musical traditions, including Cajun, Conjunta and Teano music. Swiss and Austro-German Alpine music, Argentinian tango music and many other folk genres. Right-hand manual systems Different systems exist for the right-hand manual of an accordion, which is normally used for playing the melody. Some use a button layout arranged in one way or another, while others use a piano-style keyboard. Each system has different claimed benefits by those who prefer it. They are also used to define one accordion or another as a different type. Chromatic button accordions and the bayan, a Russian variant, use a button board where notes are arranged chromatically. Two major systems exist, referred to as the B system and the C system. Diatonic button accordions use a button board designed around the notes of diatonic scales in a small number of keys. The keys are often arranged in one row for each key available. Chromatic scales may be available by combining notes from different rows. The adjective diatonic is also commonly used to describe bisonic or bisonoric accordions, that is, instruments whose right-hand manual keys each sound two different notes depending on the direction of the bellows. Such is the case, for instance, with the Argentinian Bandonian, the Austro-German Sterische Harmonica, the Italian Organetto, the Swiss Schweizer Orgelli and the Anglo Concertina. Piano accordions use a musical keyboard similar to a piano, at right angles to the cabinet, the tops of the keys inward toward the bellows. Six plus six accordions use a button board with three rows of buttons in a uniform or halt tone arrangement. The chromatic scale consists of two rows. The third row is a repetition of the first row, so there is the same fingering in all 12 scales. These accordions are produced only in special editions e.g. the Lodge Accordion, produced by H.A.R.M.O.N.A. Left-hand manual systems Different systems are also in use for the left-hand manual, which is normally used for playing the accompaniment. These almost always use distinct bass buttons and often have buttons with concavities or studs to help the player navigate the layout despite not being able to see the buttons while playing. There are three general categories. The Stradella bass system, also called standard bass, is arranged in a circle of fifths and uses single buttons for chords. The Belgian bass system is a variation used in Belgian chromatic accordions. It is also arranged in a circle of fifths but in reverse order. This system has three rows of basses, three rows of chord buttons allowing easier fingering for playing melodies, combined chords, better use of fingers 1 and 5, and more space between the buttons. This system was poorly traded outside of native Belgium. Various free bass systems for greater access to playing melodies on the left hand manual and to forming one's own chords. These are often chosen for playing jazz and classical music. Some models can convert between free bass and stradella bass. This is called converter bass. Reed ranks and switches inside the accordion are the reeds that generate the instrument tones. These are organized in different sounding ranks, which can be further combined into registers producing differing timbers. Each register stop produces a separate sound timber. See the accordion read ranks and switches article for further explanation and audio samples. All but the smallest accordions usually have treble switches. The larger and more expensive accordions often also have bass switches. Classification of chromatic and piano type accordions in describing pricing an accordion. The first factor is size expressed in number of keys on either side. For a piano type, this could for one example be 37 96 meaning 37 keys on the treble side and 96 bass keys. 
After size, the price and weight of an accordion is largely dependent on the number of reed ranks on either side, either on a cassiter or not, and to a lesser degree on the number of combinations available through register switches. Typically, these could be announced as reeds. 5 plus 3, meaning 5 reds on the treble side and 3 on the bass, and registers. 13 plus M, 7, meaning 13 register buttons on the treble side plus a special master that activates all ranks, like the tutti, on an organ, and 7 register switches on the bass side. Straps The larger piano and chromatic button accordions are usually heavier than other smaller squeeze boxes, and are equipped with two shoulder straps to make it easier to balance the weight and increase bellows control while sitting, and avoid dropping the instrument while standing. Other accordions, such as the diatonic button accordion, have only a single shoulder strap and a right-hand thumb strap. All accordions have a leather strap on the left-hand manual to keep the player's hand in position while drawing the bellows. There are also straps above and below the bellows to keep it securely closed when the instrument is not playing. Unusual accordions Various hybrid accordions have been created between instruments of different button boards and actions. Many remain curiosities, only a few have remained in use. The Schrammel accordion, used in Viennese chamber music and klezmar, which has the treble button board of a chromatic button accordion and a bisonoric bass button board, similar to an expanded diatonic button accordion. The Schweizer orgelli or Swiss organ, which usually has a three-row diatonic treble and 18 unisonoric bass buttons in a bass chord arrangement, a subset of the Stradella system in reverse order like the Belgian bass, that travel parallel to the bellows motion. The tricky tixer of the Basque people has a two-row diatonic, bisonoric treble and a 12-button diatonic unisonoric bass. In Scotland, the favoured diatonic accordion is the instrument known as the British chromatic accordion. While the right hand is bisonoric, the left hand follows the stradella system. Pedel harmony, a type of accordion used sometimes in Polish folk music, has a pair of pump organ-like bellows attached. History the accordion is a free reed instrument and is in the same family as other instruments such as the sheng and can. The sheng and can are both much older than the accordion and this type of red did inspire the kind of free reeds in use in the accordion as we know it today. The accordion's basic form is believed to have been invented in Berlin in 1822 by Christian Friedrich Ludwig Buschmann. Although one instrument has been recently discovered that appears to have been built earlier, the earliest history of the accordion in Russia is poorly documented. Nevertheless, according to Russian researchers, the earliest known simple accordions were made in Tula, Russia by Timofey Voronsov from 1820, and Ivan Sizer from 1830. By the late 1840s, the instrument was already very widespread. Together the factories of the two masters were producing 10,000 instruments a year. By 1866, over 50,000 instruments were being produced yearly by Tula and neighboring villagers. And by 1874 the yearly production rate was over 700,000. By the 1860s Novgorod, Byatka and Saratov governorates also had significant accordion production. By the 1880s, the list included Oriol, Ryazan, Moscow, Tver, Vologda, Kostroma, Nizhny Novgorod, Symbiosk and others. And many of these places created their own varieties of the instrument. The accordion is one of several European inventions of the early 19th century that used free reeds driven by a bellows. An instrument called accordion was first patented in 1829 by Cyril Damien, of Armenian origin. In Vienna Damien's instrument bore little resemblance to modern instruments. It only had a left-hand button board, with the right hand simply operating the bellows. One key feature for which Damien sought the patent was the sounding of an entire chord by depressing one key. His instrument also could sound two different chords with the same key, one for each bellows direction. 
The piano accordion was first played in German-speaking regions, and then spread over Europe. Some early portable instrument with piano keys had been invented in 1821, but it started to actually be played much later, and built its reputation from there. At that time in Vienna, mouth harmonicas with cantilin had already been available for many years, along with bigger instruments driven by hand bellows. The diatonic key arrangement was also already in use on mouth-blown instruments. Demian's patent thus covered an accompanying instrument, an accordion played with the left hand, opposite to the way that contemporary chromatic hand harmonicas were played, small and light enough for travelers to take with them and use to accompany singing. The patent also described instruments with both bass and treble sections. Although Damien preferred the bass-only instrument owing to its cost and weight advantages, by 1831 at least the accordion had appeared in Britain. The instrument was noted in the Times of that year as one new to British audiences and not favorably reviewed, but nevertheless it soon became popular. It had also become popular with New Yorkers by the mid-1840s at the latest. After Demian's invention, other accordions appeared, some featuring only the right-handed keyboard for playing melodies. It took English inventor Charles Wheatstone to squeeze both chords and keyboard together in one squeeze box. His 1844 patent for what he called a concertina also featured the ability to easily tune the reeds from the outside with a simple tool. The musician Adolf Muller described a great variety of instruments in his 1833 book Schule für Accordion. At the time, Vienna and London had a close musical relationship, with musicians often performing in both cities in the same year, so it is possible that Wheatstone was aware of this type of instrument and may have used them to put his key arrangement ideas into practice. Jern's flutina resembles Wheatstone's concertina in internal construction and tone color, but it appears to complement Demian's accordion functionally. The flutina is a one-sided bisonoric melody-only instrument whose keys are operated with the right hand while the bellows is operated with the left. When the two instruments are combined, the result is quite similar to diatonic button accordions still manufactured today. Further innovations followed and continue to the present. Various button board and keyboard systems have been developed, as well as voicings, with mechanisms to switch between different voices during performance, and different methods of internal construction to improve tone, stability and durability.